All right, for this next project, I'm gonna be doing some painting and I would like to use an artist's mall stick and rather than buy one, I'm gonna go ahead and make one. You're watching Patrick Parson Workshop. So I'm gonna start with this piece of pine. It's three quarters by one and a half by about 35 inches long. Now I'm not sure if I'm gonna need all of that length or want all of that length, but for now, I'll leave it this long. I can always cut it off if I need to later on, uh, but I think I would like to have that length so I can uh, put this, this part right here that's gonna be covered with leather off of the work surface so I don't smear anything and then I can paint more accurately uh, onto the surface. So that's the plan. And this is kind of out of necessity for the project that I'm working on. But I'm going to go ahead and build a mall stick. Should be a fun little project. done this on the router or a lot of different ways. I just thought it'd be kind of fun to use this little spoke shave. I never get to use it. Spin this just a little bit more. see I took quite a bit of wood off and I still need to do just a little bit of sanding. I'm not going to get crazy but I want to make sure I don't catch a splinter on here. And this is going to be the mall end of it here. You see I left that square. I'll show you why when I start putting the leather on. A lot of wood came off. I enjoy using the uh, spoke shave. I don't get to do that very often. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and cover this end, the end that I left square with a piece of leather. I got this from a leather remnant that I got at an antique mall and it was irregular shape, so I got a good deal on this. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this to cover the end. I'm gonna go ahead and use Gorilla Glue on this. And I've never used Gorilla Glue to glue wood to leather, so we'll see how that works. Alright, got that on there. I'm going to go ahead and just put a weight on here, and I'm going to wait for that to dry. Make sure that part is connected real solid before I move forward. So I think both of these sides are dry now, or at least close enough. And so what I want to do now, I want to fold these other sides up and get those glued down. 
And then after that is all set, I'm gonna go ahead and trim off uh, the extra. So let's go ahead and get some glue on these other sides here so you can see what I'm doing here. Cover this area real well, especially the corners there. So I'm gonna go ahead and fold that down. I'm gonna put it like that. And then, sorry you can't see this, uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing to this side. And then, same thing as before. Just gonna make sure I've got this balanced so it's gonna sit on there correctly. I think I've got that done now. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and let that dry. All right, all done with the mall stick. Not real pretty, but I think it's gonna work. Thanks everybody, hope you enjoyed it. You have been watching the Patrick Parson Workshop, which we hope you have found informative. In the comments section below, please share your thoughts, questions, and any ideas you may want us to address in the future. Also, why not consider subscribing to the channel, as every week we will have something new for you, and we would surely hate for you to miss it. As always, thanks for watching Patrick Parson Workshop.